it's home basically how America game treats like, brown people. Yeah, I mean, it's okay oh. to break in and steal all their stuff. How much? Uh, don't look like what's us. the uh, what's the bonus for being a human? By the way, when leveling, is it how many more skill points? You don't get any skill points. You have your own race. You have, you have your own racials in the uh, max. It's um, oh, okay. Every third level, you get a fate. That's just the yeah. leveling upgrade in this one. And on okay. four, every, every four level, level, you get a, level. And a, yeah, every other level. And then on the fourth level, you get a uh, attribute point. Three levels and ability. <laughs> yep. Okay, good. Okay. Gnomes are to me what goblins are to you. Let's just leave it at that. Knolls. Oh, okay. Well, I, I had no idea Gnolls, about that. Gnolls, goblins, so. same thing, different name. Hey, I speak Knoll, okay? All right, so... <clears throat> they're like a proud language and a distinct... I think we should get to the part yeah, where we kill they, demons, they in so democracy. do you guys want to, like, maybe speed this up a bit? Save me? Yeah, 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 yeah. so come on, so uh, after he tells you about all the vices, let's yeah. go. Yeah. You're the yeah, only one yeah. there, guys, you can't just yeah. What else do you want me to say? Roleplay, motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Ask me something, shit! Just poke uh, him with a stick, do something! <laughs> so, so we, we, like, so once we have the vices, we... We do. We get the flail and hit the portal. That's it. He says you're going to need uh, the whip, and you're going to need you're going to need the whip, a bonding agent, oh, and a a second piece. Like that you glue. Can make as the flail head. He says no, not like glue. Like you, a succubi. Maybe not you specifically. He points to Aurelia. Would be able to draw out the bonding agent from a succubus, but uh, uh, but it is possible, but extremely dangerous. I would recommend getting the whip instead. Can't we have okay. both? They are kind of they kind of belong together. He says um, <laughs> it'd be hard to get both of them because if you get one, the uh, the whip will descend. If you get the bonding agent, the whip will disintegrate with her. But if you kill her and get the whip, then you can't get the bonding agent anymore. Hmm. Okay. There are other places where you can get the bonding agent, though. Okay. Also, Dave, check your uh, Skype with me. Cool. So, all, is that all? Is that all we need to know? Is that it? Or is there anything else that we should? He says. Uh, he says, if you wish, I can accompany you on the journey ahead. You see, uh, I do have someone who can actually help you with this journey. You seem quite short in number. It is my apprentice. His name is Jericho. He is a pretty sassy person, but he gets the job done when it comes to fighting. I've seen it before. Coolio, I'm sure we'd... And Jericho, and Jericho, Jericho is in the back right now, and he has—he's like writing. He's having to scribe for him something. Yo, Al, did you say my name? Uh. Oh god! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Just exactly. Oh god! Oh. So, um, so he <laughs> turns over to uh, Jericho, and he says. Yes, um, would, you want, would you like to come on to an adventure with me and these other two? We're going to uh, check out a lot of knowledgeable things about the demons around the world. Oh, you bet your sweet bottom I'm coming. I like, uh, I, I sort of rush into the room and I'm like, uh, interesting, fish, and, and an elf. I've never seen the two together before. I like stand there, put my hands on my hips, and I'm just like, Put my hand I, I'm, out. I'm Jericho. Good and to I'm meet like, you, Jericho. I shake, his, shake her hand. It's like... It's okay. It's I like eye her up and down and like... You're an interesting looking elf. By the way, <laughs> what, is, what is the hotness of Aurelia, out of curiosity? Yeah. Not, not I, very? I, not very? Five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's your charisma? Uh, ten. I'm completely five. average. Uh, five. 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 Five out of ten. Five out of ten. Okay. It's like... I thought your people were supposed to be uh, a little more. Help me out here. What am I looking for? <laughs> I don't know, um, man. You're on. Al your... kind of like shakes his head and he's like, "How about we just get on to the mission? I can 
I can have my stagecoach pulled with horses drag us along on the mission with all with and carry any supplies that you may acquire. I like let go of Aurelius' hand now, really and I'm like, axe. it's like. <laughs> You don't have to hold my hand for so long. You know that, right? Uh, is this the first time you've shaken hands with a human? <laughs> oh, we we only do it for a few seconds here. <laughs> uh, I like I like walk over to the I walk over to the fish. I'm like, hi there, uh, uh, the, um, fish. Uh, sorry, I never met a race quite like yours. I stick out my hand. Like I'm yours. Jericho. <laughs> this is Tama, the terrible. Why do they call you that? That's a terrible name. I glare at me even. <clears throat> I don't. Fiercer. I don't want to get into it. <laughs> are, you lo are you looking for a fight, pal? I like my I, eyes I sort of glimmer yeah, a little bit, and I'm like, I'm, I'm like, Tama, we already owe. A, no, never mind. We uh, we already, you know, we just don't want to get in a, into, you know, any trouble. So I, I believe I that you. I my it's just, with anticipation, but don't do anything about it. It's it's just you two hunting demons. My, you must be pretty good at uh, combat. I'd love to see what no, you guys. No, we have. Do. Um, I mean, we had a, a, a. We had some other people, but it has appeared in the middle of the night, and we uh, there's a guy named Clive, and he's with us. He's a. Wait, 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 wait. wait. He's a. What's what's his last name? Uh, oh. uh, 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 what's his it's, name? It's, Drajan. It's uh, Clive Drajan. Dragon. Dra yeah, Clive Dragon, Dragon that, that's, that's it. That son of a bitch. You know Dr I hope that motherfucker dies. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the last one. That son of a bitch owed too many to people too much money. And as yeah. a guy, I hope to meet him. <laughs> well, right, so, so I that's go. I exactly. Go, we're about to go meet him, so hopefully you get your wish. I, I run upstairs and I grab my bag. And I come back down and uh, um, I, back. I, will, I will be ready in about two minutes. My uh, the program I'm using for the final character sheet decided to crash, so I'm hurriedly remaking it. Okay. Um, so <laughs> then I uh, um, I sort of I come back downstairs and they notice that I'm uh, sporting a, a pair of uh, uh, gauntlets on top of what I was wearing before, on top of my yellow robe, and, and I was like, okay. Let's go. Oh, you're also wearing a piss robe? <laughs> it's a yellow robe, yeah. It's not a piss robe. It's sort Sorry, of like more look. on the it's sort of more on the like the broadish yellow, like a canary yellow. It matches what oh, Al's okay. wearing. Right oh, hence to be. Yeah, hmm. Never mind. Um so Al's is dark, yeah, like it's like gold robe and has like gold lining and just BA. Mm -hmm. He has the hood on. Okay. I'm gonna call him Lemon Cloak. <laughs> Lemons for short. Like, okay, like, so like Al, yeah. so Alan, he says, uh, he gets onto the uh, carriage, in the front of the carriage. He's like, if you have your own mounts, you can ride with us. But anyone who doesn't is free to ride at the back. I like get on my mount. What's your mount? I haven't given it a name yet. But what is it? It's a horse. It's a horse or a. <laughs> okay. Not the name. <laughs> What is uh, it physically? So Tama. I haven't named a species yet, but it's it's like I'm riding on it. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, there is. Yeah, I guess I'm on that. With, with the professor, but you can ride in the back if you don't have a map. Um, I'm uh, I'm on Ned. Oh, okay. And Sinister is probably just riding in the back. Or are you riding with the professor? Whatever you want. I'm gonna walk. You can't walk. They're gonna go high speed once they leave the city. How oh, high speed? Can I jog? No, you can't outrun oh, it. I wasn't planning on outrunning. I was just planning on, you know. You can't catch up. You can't. You can't keep pace with it. That's what he's yeah, trying to say. Yeah. Why not? Because, because it's a horse. Because no. Because <laughs> it's, it's horses going at like thirty miles an hour. Well, I'll catch up by the evening. Then humans are more. Have more endurance than horses. No, Tom. Oh, I'll ride. I'll ride, but humans actually do have more endurance than he's, horses. He's not wrong about this, actually. Anyways, kind of riding in the front or in the back. This is important. Yes, I'll, I'll lie in the back and drink. <laughs> okay. So you guys um, are going to leave this city. Uh, as wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. 
line. He's not really my friend, and I don't like him all that much. But I know Clive. I'm not just gonna leave him. Oh yeah, we can't do that. Okay, fine. How are you going to find Clive? We're gonna go and ask around. Oh, how about I, he's I, just I, getting I, dragged? Hold on, hold on. How about he's just I, getting dragged out to the middle of the street, and you just see a fucking Clive body just hanging out, getting fucking stoned or some shit. So as you guys uh, go to like the bad part of town, how about that? You mm. leave Al behind, and I don't know if Jerrica wants to come with you guys or not. I'll come with him. Wait, so okay. Pisscloak Senior isn't coming with us? No, he's gonna sit waiting in the carriage with your uh, mounts. Oh, okay. I assume you guys are gonna leave your mounts. I don't know why you and I. Sure. Okay. Anyway, so you guys go into like the bad part of town after a while, and you see a bunch of these thugs kind of interrogating Clive in the distance. And it's like in an alleyway, so you don't know if it's Clive or not. Okay. I'll go march up to them and save them. Okay then, so you march up to them, and one of them turns around, and they push you and stop you, and, and they say, "Is it Clive? I used to I used to want to walk up to Son of a to I hate this program to the to the point where I can see if it's Clive or not that I have baby on." Yeah, you get that close, and you do see it's Clive, but just barely. He has like both of his eyes black, and he's like covered in blood and everything. He has his like his jaw is like. Argh. Well, I'm gonna shout out to Aurelia, and I'm gonna draw my weapon. Well, I mean, for fuck's sake, it's our companion that's getting beaten in that way. Of course we're going to lay into I would argue I it's been a fair amount of time since then, and he's probably dead. Well, you're still going to take vengeance. Yeah. Beat up the thugs. I mean, come on, that's that's what we do. Okay. okay. Hold up. <laughs> well, yes, but I mean, Jesus I'm going to... I'm going to sigh and say... So, like, I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm going to... Go up to the guys, the guy that has, you know, his hand on, on Tom. I'm going to be like, so why is, why is, what's up with this? Uh, they jerk a thumb back to him and he says, I don't know, he hasn't even responded in a while. Then he's probably dead. Why did you, what, why did you do this to him? What brought you to do this? He owes us quite a bit of money, little elf. Mm-hmm. I ain't paying it back now. <laughs> yeah, so you think this is going to help him make his payments? Or he's like, well, we did find some money on him, but it's not quite enough. Uh, how much money did he have on you, by the way, on Clive? Uh, it was uh, two plat and two hundred and thirty-eight silver. Okay, so it's actually uh, money I gave to him, so I'd appreciate. Not kidding. Um, he's like, should. <laughs> they tell him that uh, he still owes us about five hundred silvers. Hmm. Interesting. How are you going to get that out of him now that he's uh, in this shape? They kind of look back at him and he's like, Ugh, we actually don't know. We didn't mean to beat him up that hard. You just keep nah, on fighting. Nah, dumbasses couldn't just, you know, stop. Couldn't he's, help yourselves, huh? <laughs> they say, uh, they say, oh, look, if he wasn't fighting back, we wouldn't have to been so rough with him. How many of them are there? There's uh, two. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to charge one of them. You're right in front of them. You can't charge them. Oh, I'm gonna be diplomatic here. I'm gonna smack. Will they hurt? I, I look at her. They hurt a friend. Were you really gonna let him get away with this? I mean, this can't even be legal. So what we're doing isn't really legal. We're just defending ourselves. I feel threatened. Do you feel threatened? This is self-defense. <laughs> um. Okay. So, Doc. Before <laughs> any of this happens, he just <laughs> says in front of them. <laughs> what? What? So before any of this happens, I want to sort of walk past the elf and the fish, and I was like, oh. Oh, it's you, gents. What do we have here? Ah, it's that Clive bastard. He's looking He's like, a little yeah. more colorful than he normally looks. He's like, yeah, we finally found him after all these years, and these assholes says that they're with him. I didn't say I was with him. I'm asking you what you're doing with him. Well, no, it's fine, it's fine. Let me, let me, let me get this. I, I got this. Uh, uh, really? Oh. Yeah, I got this. Just hold up. Gentlemen, uh... <clears throat> so, uh, you know, he might have been the one that owed my professor money, but, uh, you know, look at him. He's, he's pretty bent up. I think that's probably worth 500 silvers, don't you think? I'm certainly arms, happy with that result. They cross their arms and they say, fine, but he didn't just owe your professor money. 
No, but I, I guess we no. can't get anything from him now. <laughs> well, how about this? How about uh, how about we give uh, you you give us? No, 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 no. Give us his body. No. We'll his take body. him off your hands. I look at around. His body. This is about vengeance, about honor, about brotherhood. How could you just? <laughs> it is about brotherhood. We can't just let these thugs get away with. I, I turn around and it's like, hush, please. No. I turn around and say. Why don't you gentlemen go on your way, and I, like, uh, hand them some silver each. <laughs> How much? I, I, no, uh, we're not paying any more money to these guys. <laughs> I pay, I How pay, much? I pay them, uh, ten silver apiece. And they kind of take it, and they're like, fine. And then they and walk they off. And they kind of just leave. And then they I'm like, leave. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, trying to walk past me, I'm gonna shoulder check one of them. <laughs> yeah, they kind of like they kind of like walk past you guys. I'm not even gonna shoulder check him. I'm gonna punch him square in the gut. <laughs> Come on, guys! For fuck's sake, can we get to the demon hunting <laughs> oh part God. of this game? It would okay. be faster to just kill the bastards. They we... are leaving. I can kill them. Like I can kill them. Seriously, I'm rolling kill them like that. That's it's true. Do it fine. Really Take your punch. punch. Take your punch. Uh... Suddenly, ten of them pop out of nowhere. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, you punch him in the gut. Let's go. That is a sexy picture. Yes, I was inspired by the succubus. I was like, succubus. I need to draw succubus. I already drew this party over here, so now it's a succubus here. Which one got offed? Or is that not our current party? That's not our current party. I'm just draw drawing a party of midgets and a wizard. Epic bird is epic. Yeah, it's, it's anyway, like the world's so fattest and... Um, um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go up to Clive. Is Clive alive? Do I? Clive's dead. He's dead. And we did like how, far this feels like... how far from dead? How far dead? He's cold. He's getting cold. Oh. This feels, this feels like Roll really... Roll damage, uh, by the way. How much damage I did? How much damage do you do with an arm? 1d3. Plus your strength. Come on, bro. 1d3. 1d... Did you actually draw in the naughty bit? No, there's no nipples. No, what's this? <laughs> uh, that's her crotch. You tend to have a crotch. What, 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 what the fuck do your legs come attached to otherwise? <laughs> yeah, that's true. You're, I, I don't know if you've ever looked in the mirror, but your crotch does have a, this shape to it. <laughs> what the fuck? How yeah, do you it's have... actually kind of important. That ha You'd be that amazed. That is a lot of damage for someone who... Whoa, man, that's a lot of damage. For a punch. <laughs> but it's non-lethal. Non-lethal. Okay. So you punch him in the gun, he falls down, and the other thug's like, Whoa, whoa, we don't want any trouble, we're leaving! Well, then I, any... I, I, I just looked at him and I hand over your gold and silver. <laughs> They're like, we're not going to give you our money. You we killed our... pay to our boss. You killed our friend. This, this, this demands retribution. Either in coin or in blood. Yeah, they... They're like... They're pretty terrified because, you know, he has weapons and armor. And they're like, fine, you know what? Take the money back. All of it. And they just throw it at him, and some of it falls, ah, some of it falls to the ground. Including the don't, 20 silver Jericho just gave them. And they're just Don't bend over and pick it up. Now. I glare at them while they leave. I believe I let them bend over and pick it up. Anyway, no, there's clearly a vagina on that succubus. No, <laughs> no it's a crotch. Let's uh, let's let's get on with the game, gentlemen. We've been enough the time is. like alternate ca alternating characters here. Jesus yeah. Christ, yeah, this what is supposed to be like? This? I mean, it's it's your fault. You had like a twenty-minute suicide. Yes. Well, it's not my fault. <laughs> Clive rode spectacularly in that battle. Yeah. By the way, fucking Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's crazy. So they run off, and you guys get all your money back. So you get your however much Clive had. Uh, let me just find it for you right now because I have. I'm gonna add it. half of whatever you had to my character. It's actually three platinum, yeah. two hundred and eighty-three silver. I I I, I walk okay. up and I take my twenty silver pieces back and I'm like, and that was uncalled for, gentlemen and lady. Shall we go? I still regret I didn't kill them. Yes, I follow him. Three right. platinum. Okay, so you guys silver. finally well, we get back to. Uh, to the professor, and he says, Oh, you guys are finally back. Oh, I guess it didn't take that long. Are you ready to go now? Yes, and I'm happier than ever. You ha you'll, you'll be happy to know, Professor, that Clive has met his end. 
he nods. He's like, I guess not completely happy, but okay. Let us be And, <laughs> yeah, so should we take a break here? Absolutely. Sure someone besides me has to take a leak. Absolutely. Uh, yeah. Thank you very much for joining us, guys. We're going to take a probably a 10-minute break here while everyone no. uh, does things and whatnot. Thank you very much for seeing Clive to his grisly end. That was a fantastic battle. I love that. Uh, so <laughs> hopefully Jericho is going to be awesome. We've got so many good things planned. Oh, my God. Anyway, guys, we'll be back in 10 minutes. Don't, don't go anywhere. Yeah. Yeah. We are back from intermission. Welcome back, everyone. Yep. Welcome back. Uh, Die Party Demon Hunt Part 2. Week 5, I think. It's week 5, five right? Two. Yeah. Yep. <sighs> so. We are, um... Take it away, Ducky. Yep. You guys, after a... Another couple of weeks of travel and getting to know everything, and you do the new the new guys who don't know Al know that uh, he's pretty damn wise at this point, mm -hmm. and he's a very powerful lightning mage. That's mm -hmm. why he has such fancy robes, and that his staff is made out of extremely expensive wood that comes from the uh, fairy continent. But anyway, anyway, what's his uh, name? His name's Alan Whiteford. Alan. Okay, Alan. Yep. Yeah, he's been called Al, though, so if you want to be proper with him, you call him Alan. I'll call yeah. him Piss Cloak if or I professor. want to. Shit. <laughs> anyway, you guys... Uh, I'm, I'm going I'm to call him Professor. You guys uh, go into a small village. Oh, no, I guess not a small village. It's kind of big. But it's still a village and called Whisper Rock. And it's a pretty dwarf-heavy village, actually, but there's still plenty of uh, humans. It's kind of a 40-60 spot with dwarves taking the lead. Um, and so, yeah. That's where you guys head off, and upon entering, you see a guard at the door because they have to wall it. They have, like, these new fresh walls, and they say, um, do you guys have any reports on the demons about? I, uh, I speak up. Do you have any reports? <laughs> um, I, I speak up, I was like, you. Ah, oh, uh, our new party members might know a thing or two about this. I mean, uh, this one here, the elf. He was with uh, a party that's supposedly Gee. gone and uh, shut down one of these demon portals, or found one. I can't remember. What was it? We found one and then kicked a whole bunch of demon ass. There you go. They found one. We slew hundreds. <laughs> found Thousands, where, even. Where did you find them? Uh, Fine. another continent, but what's important now is that there's a lot here that we're trying to shut down. Of course we know that there's a lot here. They're everywhere, and they're taking all the soldiers. I wish we had a completely female platoon to go in there. Oh. <laughs> well, you know what? Uh, I, I would be glad to help. Uh, I will not fall to the succubi's, you know, tactics. I mean, will he, you now? I don't. <laughs> he nods and he says, "Yeah, but are you going in there alone? That's mad. Are you, or are you going to bring these others with you?" Well, you know. Of course she is. What are you talking about? We're they're, they're coming with me, but I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably raising doing a lot of, a lot of the, a lot of the heavy work. Oh boy. Hold on one second. Holding on. Bracing. Damn it. <laughs> put your head between your knees and put your hands on your ankle. Now, uh, start okay. moving forward. And so, that the is guard, horrible. he says, all right, well, the only person that we have, or the only person that we have that has any knowledge about uh, where, if you want to fight some of the bigger demons, the only person that has any knowledge about that is going to be in the tavern. It's, uh, we don't really know much about him, but I'm sure that he can help you and maybe even come along on your quest. Okay. The tavern Sounds is good. called, the tavern's called the Wet Rock. It's just down the street. The Wet Rock, okay. I, uh, as soon as we get past the guard, I'm gonna look at Tama, I'm gonna say, don't fucking stab anybody, okay? 
I glare at him. I'll try my best. Her. Glare at her. To not her. Jeez. To stab. No, well, wait. I'll try my best not to stab. Or wait. Yes, I'll, not to stab. Yes. Don't stab. So you guys enter the tavern. Minimal stabbing. And you see, uh, you see the only guy who would remotely be what he was talking about. He actually has gear on that looks like is for killing anything that's more than a fly. And so, sure. uh, yeah. Other yeah, than that, though, it's a pretty empty tavern it. because people are too busy, you know, worrying of not dying. <laughs> worrying about not dying, yeah. Well, this place yeah. is a bit of a downer. I'm going to go get some <laughs> alcohol. I, like, walk up to the front of the, the, the bar, and I'm like, Marky! So, yes. is Al still with us, or is Al no longer with us? Uh, Al is in the tavern, but he's kind of waiting at the door with his cane. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I got Al covered. I know what he likes to drink. Um, so, I'm yeah. Going to go with alcohol. I guess I'll, I'll go and, and uh, Talk to the introduce guy, myself to the, the guy. All right. Not very charismatic, so I'm going to say, Hello, my name is Aurelia Zamora. Uh, would you like to help us kill demons? Kind of kind of look up at him like, D Demons? Uh, what, what does he look like, for the record? Like, she. what do I see? She. Uh, she. She. Oh, that's she. Yeah, she has a description. Humongous boobies. Uh, no. <laughs> I have an okay description. <laughs> Yes, yes. Give me, give me your character description, good sir. Give me your breast sizes. No. <laughs> are we talking like 36, 24, um, 30? Like, what are we? What are we? What kind mind is your vagina? No. I'm, I'm like five ten. Like tall for an elf. A little uh, tall for an elf. A little five, on the ten? heavier side. That's so one forty. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I, I have gray eyes and purple hair, and on the you know attractiveness scale, for an elf. Probably a five out of ten. I'm pretty average looking. Not bad. Not good. Um, so whatever I've ordered from I, I have I have a giant axe. So whatever I've okay, ordered so from everyone from the bar, I walk over to the table, and I sit right next to the character that we're we're introducing ourselves to, and I sit down and I plunk a a tabard of ale in front of him, and I go. So I hear you killed demons. Fascinating. Yes, I've uh, I've I've dealt with demons before. Not a. I'm like sitting there, just like, not with such a large party all the time. But are you? Are both of you interested in? Kids? <laughs> Whew, that was refreshing. Yeah, he's tagging along <laughs> with us. You're not gonna drink that. <laughs> I got it for you. Oh. By the way, it's just dark right. ale. It's like dwarf drink. Yeah. It's like okay. pretty strong shit. So I'm, I'm going to kind of like pick it up and eye it over. I don't uh, kind of pick it up and I look at the box. Like, what's the, what's the glass look like? It's a wooden mug. And uh, uh, I'm kind of like hand gesturing to like the bar cape. You know, like holding up two fingers and like. And I turn back. Uh, I'm going to have a. I'm going to have a. I'm going to do something. I'm going to just do something odd with the character, but that's cool. Uh. I'm going to have an other glass, like an empty glass over to my side. I'm going to take it and I'm going to pour the ale into the other glass and then look in the bottom of the cup and nod and then drink out of my own cup. Uh, and say, so, since you're here for the, uh, the demons, you know that their leader is up in an abandoned fort. Interesting. Well, I guess it's not They're abandoned the, now, is it? The, the leader of this continent? Of the demons on this continent, or the the leader of the demons, the leader of the succubi, of the succubi. Is it male? I don't really know how large. Let's just say that the people. The information is a bit sketch. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. I don't really can't say that it's a, all of them. It could be three of them, but the fort's abandoned. You'd you'd be I, surprised I like, uh, how quickly 